tonight, Florida's Education Commissioner is facing backlash after backing out of a town hall meeting that would discuss the state's new standards for teaching black history. Local leaders are sharing their disappointment, but maintain that his absence will not stop them from tackling the controversial classroom decisions. CBS News Miami's Ted Scouten joins us with the latest. And I just feel it's such disrespect for, for him not to be there to take questions from the black community. Margaret Reed is coming to tonight's town hall. She is helping raise her great grandson and had questions for Florida Education Commissioner Manny Diaz Jr. But he will be a no-show. You know, we have a lot of questions we want to ask him. It's like you post this meeting, now you're not going to show up to this town hall meeting. I'm still going to attend, but it just bothers me that you just weighed this off. The commissioner was billed to appear on a panel along with local elected officials to discuss the new African-American history standards. It tells educators to teach how slaves develop skills, which in some instances could be applied for their personal benefit. As leaders, if we're, if we're bold enough to put forth these policies, we have to be bold enough to, to defend them and defend them in front of the people who they affect regardless of what, of what the response might be. State Senator Chevron Jones organized the town hall. More than 1,300 people have RSVP'd. He said Diaz told him earlier this week that he would not be able to make it. You were coming to address the people uh, who reside here in this state. And for there to be an empty chair tonight for the leadership as far as when it comes to education here in Florida, as unfortunate. Responding to a tweet from CBS News Miami's Jim DeFeedy, Diaz said, there was nothing sudden about my inability to attend Senator Jones Town Hall. As I told the Senator last week, I will be visiting schools throughout the state to welcome back students, parents, and teachers for the first day of school. Senator Jones thinks there's more behind it. Now we're dealing with DeSantis running for president. And so I believe that was a large impetus behind the, the governor's office telling him, you're not doing this. Today, the Florida Department of Education tweeted out pictures of the commissioner at schools in Osceola County. Reed still has questions. I don't understand why he can't be there. It's a conflict with what schedule at 7 o'clock? How, how many things you got going on at 7 p.m. that you can't come to this meeting? The town hall gets underway at 7 p.m. Jones said that he is hoping that the commissioner as well as the governor's office will be tuning in to hear the concerns of the residents. In Miami Gardens, Ted Scouting, CBS News Miami.